WFNN. Headline News Update. <clears throat> Hi everyone, Basil Chapman here for the 3 p.m. Tiger Financial News Network Market Update. Dow is up 19 at 34,502. It had a screamer of a run today up to the 35,000 level. And then all of a sudden, news, I uh, guess, unfolded that just the market didn't like. And I pulled back really sharply. Now we're only up 12. The S&P, same thing. S&P had a, a really strong day. It went above yesterday's high, in fact. It went all the way to 46.52. It's trading right now at 45.82. Um, that, <laughs> that's quite a pullback. It is now only up 15 and was up, I mean, you can imagine, up, up in the eight, eight, up 80 or more points. And now we're looking at the QQQ, the NDX 100, same thing, actually trading now at the low of the day. It's at 93.22, uh, down 61 cents. It was up all the way to 400.48, but it needed to go higher than that to extend that leg that we were talking about. I'll talk about these patterns in a moment. Let me just show you this briefly in the, in, in the Chapman wave, uh, waveform. We're looking at a sharp move down and then an arch formation. If it fails at a peak A or B and breaks the left side low, that can become quite serious. So we're watching this very closely because the Qs, the NDX 100, has been a leader for, for most of the year. IWM. Uh, had a fabulous early move, announced down at 156 at 216.59. Not very good, almost at the low of yesterday. And we're looking at gold, which is doing okay. It's up about seven points at 1783. It needs to get to the 1784, uh, sorry, 1808 to the 1812 level. Uh, we're looking at uh, the dollar. The dollar is holding okay. Near the, the recent highs of 96.64, it's at 96.03, it's just up 10 ticks. What we are looking at, though, and this is going to be very important, is that bonds have had another rally going from the low today of 149.79 to the TLT trading right now at 151.73 towards the high of the day. Uh, this is suggesting that yields are coming down. We'll talk about that when I do the Tom O'Brien show in a few moments' time. And what's really interesting about this is that um, the Fed is talking about raising rates, but in fact, um, the, it's doing it by themselves. And crude oil is down, was up earlier on, it's down 58 cents, had a very big pullback from the 85 to the 65. I would say 20 points is a big pullback. We'll be back in a few minutes for the uh, last hour of trading. Basil Chapman sitting in for Tom O'Brien. Look forward to it, should be a great last hour. We'll be back in a few moments, hope you can say, and don't forget my opening call, my date news. I'll be back.